I think if Australian wineries can sell everything at home, then there's no worries. But there aren't that many. This isn't a very big country. And apart from the else, the danger is even if you can sell everything at home, are you evolving? Are you learning? And one day maybe your local customers might give up. So um, you need to export. As an industry, perhaps we placed a lot of emphasis on traditional markets, such as you know, the North American, Canadian market, um, UK. But Northeast and Southeast Asia are really the, the exciting places where the ability to take premium offer exists. And that's where you can, where you can make some money. Having said that, in the, in the traditional markets as well, particularly North America, the perception of, of brand Australia is on the rise. The economic conditions now are favourable as well, so you have not just the, the, I guess, the holistic reasons for exporting and being part of that global community, but you have economic reasons now that are much more favourable and you have a lot of interest from people overseas in, in our wines. Um, so timing is currently very good. I think the world has evolved quite a lot in recent years in terms of new markets. Um, Asia particularly, uh, China is the obvious one, but you're seeing things happening in places like Vietnam and other countries coming along. And you've got a whole new audience, um, both in those countries, but also even in places like the States and, and in Europe. You've got a young generation of wine drinkers for whom Australia will be a new experience. I remember about eight years ago, I walked into a bar in, in the States and I walked in and the first thing they said was, don't talk to me about Australian wine, which can be a bit defeating. That attitude's completely changed. It's now, what have you got? Show me what you've got. There's excitement around it. And um, you know that excitement's infectious. And if we all get on board and all push hard at it collectively, then there's, there's weight in numbers. Success breeds success.